All right, hello everyone. The time is 1742. We're currently in resettlement. Um, I wanted to explain two ICT terms or trading terms generally, if you're not familiar with them, and that's going to be turtle suit pattern and uh, liquidity pools. So let's get right into it. Um, by the way, I need the money, so use my affiliate links because uh, I need it. Um, okay, uh, with that being said, I will explain two, uh, two terms that you will hear me use if you watch my trading sessions, um, turtle soup pattern and uh, liquidity pools. So turtle soup pattern, let's see if we can find a good one here. It's going to be right there. A turtle soup pattern is a break. Uh, it's basically a sweep. If you hear me say the term sweep versus a run, a sweep of a high is where it just pokes above a high and then comes back down. Could be a low as well. I usually see things to the short side. That's probably a mistake, but I see things more on the short side for whatever reason. Um, it's basically just a, a small sweep above a high and then a drive lower. So it ties right in with your liquidity pool concept. There are resting orders from market makers and from market participants that rest above every high and every low, no matter how short term, whether it's a one minute high, five minute high, it's all scalable, it doesn't matter, above every single one of these swing points. So was there a liquidity pool here? Yeah, there was. This down here is a liquidity pool. So we had a liquidity pool here below at 059 spot 50. The resting liquidity from your lead market makers uh, is going to be always resting below highs and lows. You don't need bookmap to see that. They're above every high and low, no matter how small the swing. Whether it's a one minute swing, again, 30 minute swing, it doesn't matter. The liquidity is always above highs and lows. Your lead market makers play there. Um, so with that being said, what is a turtle soup pattern? This is not really what I would call a turtle soup as we fully ran this low and we, we came deeply explored this liquidity. That might get into a standard projection Standard projection swing, talk about that at some point later. Um, turtle soup is not this green box, really. Turtle soup is the green box that I highlighted. It is a sweep of a prior high or low that immediately goes back into the prior range. That is a turtle soup pattern. Are turtle soup patterns tradable? Absolutely, they are. Um, but they're difficult to trade, okay? They're difficult because you don't really know if it's going to be a sweep or a run before it happens. Uh, it usually comes after like multiple. So see here, we, usually like multiples of three, one, two, three. That third push up there is probably going to be a turtle soup. Your best guess is that after one, two, three sweeps of prior highs, the last one is probably going to turtle soup. That is the best that I can tell you. If you're just trying to trade turtle soups, they're also known as fake breakouts, Judas swings, whatever but I, I just use the turtle soup term. Um, <clears throat> they're just these little sweeps above a prior high into a liquidity pool and then back down. Um, and it's the same concept on the long side. So what is a liquidity pool? A liquidity pool rests above every single high and low. It is an area in which you will have resting orders from your lead market makers. Um, and it's also where you will have stop orders from, could be institutions, could be day traders, whatever. Usually the market's going after big money, not small money. So institutional side, um, stops are going to rest above every high and low and lead market makers resting orders are going to be there to counter that. As you can see in a low volatility environment, oftentimes you are going to see these like turtle soup patterns. Um, when the market is not super volatile, you're going to get these pushes into, into liquidity pools that fairly quickly reject. So if you hear me use the term, is this going to turtle soup? Is this going to turtle soup? That's basically what it is. It's a small breach into a liquidity pool, sweep into a liquidity pool, and then back down. Or on the long side, sweep into a liquidity pool and then back up. So we can see here that we had a turtle soup pattern right here. Into that liquidity, right back up. That's a turtle soup pattern. Liquidity pool goes right with that. Resting above every single short term high and low is going to be your lead market makers and stop orders. Okay, The lead market makers are going to have their limit orders there to be counterparties to the stop orders. That is how they make their money. And basically, that is what a turtle soup pattern is as well as liquidity pool. 
This also goes into a, another term I'll get into. A sweep is a small breach above a high. A run is a full exploration into that high, into that liquidity. That's a run of a higher low. So there you go, sweep and low, liquidity pool, and turtle soup. I will be back on for more uh, live trading sessions, the long videos, um, later. Bye.